Jank Odo moment. So yeah, let's take on the gym leader. We have to first talk to her though. You kept me waiting. I'm Eterna's gym leader, Gardenia, the grass type master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura with about you. So anyway, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. Yep. Let's have some fun. Guard I like Gardenia because she has a turtle egg on her team. So that's pretty cool. Cheribi, okay. That's pretty cool. But my team. Okay. Same, same level, actually. Cool. Let's start with the wing attack. Let's see how much it does. Let's see how much will this do. Uh, one hit KO. Okay, cool. So there goes the Shuribi. Next is her turtle Yep. Okay. We gotta keep Karen in. Okay, use wing attack. I don't know, Turtwig is pretty bulky. I think it can take the hit, yeah. So it's gonna take more than one hit. Okay. Grass Knot is um a move that the heavier Pokemon the Pokemon is, the more damage it'll do. So like it does a really good amount on um, like a Snorlax or something. Or like a Whaleoid. Heavy Pokemon, I guess, to be specific there. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. Let's go with uh, she's gonna use she's probably gonna use a potion or something, like a super potion. So I'm gonna go with the wing attack again. Yeah, let's hope this doesn't heal Tetra all the way up to the full health. Okay, it does. Cool. Good for Gardenia, I guess. That's cool for her. So now let's probably put it back in the reds again. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna just use another wing attack. Okay, there we go. She didn't even heal that time, but she did that at least once. I was expecting that, really. Okay, and then her last Pokemon is a Rose Raid. It's the evolved form of Roselia, which is pretty cool. Yeah, I don't want to switch up Pokemon. I want to try to like, go for an epic Mercury Squeep or something, you know? So this thing's level 22, so it's a really big, it's higher level than probably maybe your best Pokemon even, or highest level Pokemon. Um, it also has a Citrus Berry held on, held on, as, as held item, I'm pretty sure, so keep that in mind. I'm gonna just go for another Wing Attack, see what she does. Grass Knot again, okay. So this this does, ten, that did about 7 HP on my Karen. On Karen, I should say. So yeah, hopefully this is always half. Good, that's what I wanted. But then, yep, there goes the citrus berry. Okay, I think I can faint it with one more wing attack. As long as Karen can take the next hit, it's gonna go for a poison sting. Okay. Wing attack hits. Let's see if this faints the rose raid. If it, it does, it'll be an epic, yeah, it's an epic Mercury Sweep now, awesome. Nice. And Karen go to level 20, nice. So many level ups these past couple of videos, you know? Almost another level, wow. Amazing, you're, you're very good, aren't you? Thanks for the 2,640 Poké Dollars, though. Appreciate it, Gardenia. It might be... I might have said it before, but you're really tough. Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be so good? Not really, it just took some dedication, you know? I'm guess, I guess that a measure, that's a measure of how much your po you love your Pokemon. In recognition of that, I proudly grant you this. We get the Forest Badge from Gardenia. Nice. And I'll show them the badge case in a second. With the Forest Badge, your Pokemon can use the hidden move cut outside of battle. Now that you have two badges, all Pokemon you received in trades will obey you up to level 30. I've also got something else, it's a gift from me. Team 86, which is Grass Knot, I explained it in the battle box, but she'll explain it here. Uh, that, that, team, that Team 86 contains the move Grass Knot. It's one of my favorite moves. The heavier the foe, the more damage this move will cause. So like again, a Snorlax and a Whale Lord would get probably faint or something. Or, take a lot of damage from it you know because they're super heavy yeah um other than that you can just i mean i don't know why i'm walking but you can make your way out of the gym but first i want to talk to the vice giver and check the statue again oh steven you beat the gym leader your pokemon look much tougher than when when they went in too cool at least that's how i see it thank you that's very cool of you to say nice of you to say too 
Um, Eternals City Pokemon Gym Leader Gardenia Crossfire Certified Trainers Sam Steven. Okay, cool. We're on the we're on the statue automatically.